Hey everybody, it's Bones. It's Joshua. Craft Connoisseurs Beer Review Time yep. number two. Number two. For Imprint. We yep. don't always do two, but when we get, I mean, over 10 beers, it's flavors from one drop. It's well, only we, right. And we got so many different kinds this time. That's such a good point. Mm -hmm. uh, the smoogie is what Imprint's known for. for sure. However, they've got a lot of cool people that they work with and constantly seem to be collabing. Oh, I yeah. mean, like, non stop. I, I love it. And yeah. for us, when people collab together, that's a really good opportunity for them to try like uh, different methods because coast to coast, like a sour is not the same. <laughs> I think people, we can, even customers coming to our store saying like, oh, you guys, I love sours. And we're mm -hmm. like, awesome. That's a super good baseline. That's like, <laughs> if you like beer, beer gets crazy. Well, so do sours. Yeah. And it can get anywhere from something light, like what we have here from them, Double Rain Bro. This is a collaboration with Bolero Snort Brewery. You heard it. This is a Skittles Sour, based essentially on, you got it, Skittles. Skittles. I think they abbreviate it to Skit Sour. Mm -hmm. This is a really fun play, a lot lighter. Mm -hmm. Look at that. This is Wild Cherry. Wild Cherry. I don't think we said that. I'm excited. Look at it. It even says it collab really good. on the can. Smells really good. I don't know about you, but I absolutely oh. love Skittles. Yeah. Always have, always will. Let me nose test. Mm hmm. Awesome. This really gives me, uh, if I'm being just off the nose, the old 450 vibes of oh. a nice sour. Mm -hmm. Yeah, let's get it. Oh, it's so smooth. Oh, it's not for as much bubbles as you see. It's you would think it bubbly. would, yeah. You would feel like it would be more effervescent. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. That's interesting. Mm -hmm. Yeah, like it, there's a you can clear. There is a mm -hmm. lot of bubbles happening, but on the palate, it's much smoother. Very like, crushable. It has like the ability. Yeah, I was like, I could just like tip it easy. The chip, uh, ch ch the cherry flavor. Yeah, is not medicinal. I think no. that's something to make note of. I, lo I know a lot of people get. Uh, cautious when it comes to that because sure. it may come off like a cough syrup. I get none of that vibe. No, no, no. It's all. definitely pretty fresh. Has you, has like a back end of the beer a little bit. Like yeah. I, can, I can just a hint of it. A sour. A sour. A true sour. It's yeah. great for that. Like mm -hmm. again, that makes it highly drinkable. Yeah, yeah, sure. yeah, definitely. But also sweet enough for those who are scared away from like really sour sours. It's definitely sweet enough to really enjoy it for sure. Great summer. This is a great game. Yeah. Oh, yeah. You're like, I haven't tried a sour that I like, or mm -hmm. you're still in beer land. These ones are nice. Yeah. Um, and crisp. Crisp. Yeah. Honestly, yeah, yeah. we carry a lot of stuff everywhere from a lighter thing like this all the way to a thick smoothie. So mm -hmm. definitely, um, we'll be keeping more and more variety like this to come. He's going to have a little more. Uh, and we have a lot of fun things still projected for the end of the month. Yeah, Hopefully, for sure. I think three more drops from different breweries in the yeah. next couple weeks. So hoping. Yes. <laughs> you know how that goes. Keep your eyes peeled mm -hmm. and we will see you on the next one. Thank you.